Baltimore Orioles have been enjoying the sweet music coming out of Chris Davis's bat so far this season. 50 home runs for the Orioles slugger. He's been breaking out in a big way. Alongside Pedro Gomez and Rick Sutcliffe, I'm Adnan Burke. Just the third player ever, Pedro, with 50 home runs and 40 doubles. Albert Bell, Babe Ruth also on the list. As you take a look at these numbers, You've been around the game. You've heard people say about Davis, the Rangers. Put this into context for us. I mean, anytime you're on any list with Babe Ruth, you know you're in outstanding company. So that alone says it all. You know, the Albert Bell numbers came in 144 game season. That was the strike season. That makes those numbers even more impressive. But the thing about Chris Davis is I, I don't know that the Orioles necessarily knew exactly what they were getting. I mean, John Daniels, the Rangers GM, said, boy, did we blow that one <laughs> when they hit, talking about the trade from two years ago from the Rangers to the Orioles. But nobody knew that Chris Davis was going to become this type of player. I think the Orioles knew exactly what they were getting when they hired Buck Showalter. And Chris Davis is not the only example, but I know what Buck Showalter has done in the past. He has always been a teacher. And what he did with Chris Davis was he said, if you get yourself in this situation, you're going to succeed. But if you let the pitcher get you into this situation, you're going to continue to fail. So all he does right now, he has created his zone, and now he knows his zone. So anytime a pitcher comes into that zone, he's ready to do some damage. If he's in another zone where he's not able to produce like he can when he's swinging at the pitches he's supposed to, he stays away from those pitches for the most part. That, to me, is the reason it's all come together. The teaching, again, of Buck Showalter. Every hit indispensable right now for that Baltimore Orioles team still very much on AL wildcard race.